the Tuesday lesson focuses on one of the most amazing part of the story of the two witnesses. We are told in the book of Revelation chapter 11, verse 7, that when they finish their testimony, the beast that ascends out of the bottomless pit will make war against them, overcome them, and kill them. We see that the two witnesses finishing their testimony in sackcloth because that is what it tells us in the Greek. So we know that something happened to the two witnesses near the end of 1,200 years prophecy that ended in 1798. Did something happen then? See, when you go back to the book of Daniel chapter 7, Daniel speaks of a little home power who he says shall speak pompous words against the Most High and shall persecute the sins of the Most High and shall tend to change times and law. Then the saints shall be given into his hands for a time, times, and half a time. The papal dominance lasted from 538 AD to 1798, when the French general Berthier, on the order from Napoleon, marched on a post into Rome on February 10, 1798. Post Pius VI was taken captive and brought to France, where he died. This date marked a prophetically predicted end of the papal, later on, secular power authority by Daniel. In the French Revolution, the government officially established the court of reasoning as a state-sponsored atheistic religion, intending to replace Christianity. A festival of reason was held nationwide on November 10, 1793. Churches across France were turned into temple of reason, and a living woman was enthroned as the goddess of reason. Bible were banned in the street. God was declared non-existent, and death was pronounced to be an endless sleep. Satan worked through godless man to kill God's two witnesses, the Bible, so to speak. Their dead bodies would lie in the street of the city, which spiritually is called Sodom and Egypt. We know Egypt was a culture of many gods that denied the true God. And of course, with Sodom represent a gross immorality. In the French Revolution, God's two witnesses, the Old and the New Testament of the Bible, lay dead as a result of atheism and immorality that ran rampant. All these lasted for three and a half years until the French government removed its restrictive religious law on June 17, 1797, where the two witnesses resurrected, and more about that tomorrow.